Hello, I'm for Bear Street, and in my last video, I discussed how Minecraft 1.19 is most likely going to be an end update. So if you haven't already seen that video, I recommend that you watch that video here. Also, before that, I had 5 suggestions for structures for Minecraft 1.18. However, in this video, I'm going to be combining these two ideas to show you 3 structure suggestions for Minecraft 1.19, if it is actually an end update. However, before I begin, I just wanted to say that only a small percentage of you are actually subscribed. So if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. Okay, let's jump straight into it. So, as you should know, the only real structure in the end are the end cities, and they get really repetitive, and they are a design that is just under 5 years old, so it's quite a dated structure, which is why my first structure suggestion is the Ender Dome. This purple glass dome would be quite big and have pink stripes going through them. Also, on the inside, it would have quite a unique design using the purple blocks as well as endstone bricks and emeralds. There'll be plenty of shulkers inside this structure, also just like the end cities, which have these purple banners. I decided that this structure should also have a unique banner. Also, to add more detail to the floor, I added four pathways leading in and out of this new ender structure. Okay, so that was quite a large structure, so the next two are going to be quite a bit smaller. So, as I previously mentioned, the only real structure in the end are the end cities. And to get to these end cities before you have an elytra, you'll have to bridge across the void to get to other end islands. Which is where this structure comes into play. So, in every small end island biome, there would be one of these small floating end houses. These would have a chest in the center and it would have the same kind of loot that you would find in a natural end city. Also, this structure would only be quite small, but it would definitely make the end feel more alive, as there is a major problem with the end right now, as the end is really empty, and you could travel for hundreds if not thousands of blocks before coming across an end city. So, this much smaller and more common structure would 100% fix that. Now, on the opposite side of that are people who are using Elytra, and generally, they just fly above the end islands. It makes sense, right? I mean, why wouldn't you? Well, you wouldn't want to miss out on any of those amazing end cities, would you? Well, maybe not anymore, with the Ender Dragon Egg Sanctuary. These small structures would only spawn under the end islands, and close to Y level 0. They would have a very simple endstone brick design. And, just like the Ender Dome earlier, this Minecraft 1.19 structure would also have a unique banner pattern. Additionally, this structure would be home to another dragon egg. Maybe a different type of dragon egg, like a blue one. However, it would be trapped, so if you destroyed it or tried to move it, the entire structure would explode. Now, there needs to be an actual reason to go there, which is why there should be a super overpowered chest that has items like netherite scraps and max enchanted tools and armor. And so, those are my 3 Minecraft 1.19 structure suggestions. If you enjoyed the video, remember to like that smash button as well as subscribing. Also, if you want to see some Minecraft 1.18 structure suggestions, watch this video. Or if you want to know everything hidden that was in the Minecon Live 2021 trailer, watch this video. And thank you for watching.